Hey guys, this is Jarek, and uh, I'm making this video. First of all, there will be more airsoft videos uploaded very, very soon, so don't comment about that. Second of all, this rant is kind of spawned by uh, one of my later videos I just uploaded. I think I uploaded yesterday, two days ago almost. Uh, legendary gameplay. As you guys all know, that game got terrible reviews. Uh, I think IGN gave it about a 2.5. First of all, I never agree with IGN. I think they're com they're a bunch of idiots. They never have a good opinion on anything. But uh, I saw someone else give it about a 5.5, which was the highest I saw of it. Well, I found this game to actually be a lot of fun. I'd give it about a 7.5. That's my opinion. I liked the game. I thought it was a lot of fun. Um, other than that... It's, what drives me crazy is why do you need a reviewer or a critic to tell you what's good? It's not like you need to have someone following you, telling you, this is a good game, you have to like this game, this is a bad one, you have to hate that one. The only way you're going to tell if you like it or not is to play it. I got Legendary, I played it, and um, I liked it. I was in for a surprise, I was expecting a low-budget, terrible game, that's what I was expecting. Then again, I never really pay for my games. I'm gonna not say any more about that, but I thought it was a great game. If I had to go and buy it, I would buy it. That's how much I liked it. So I don't know why people will always go off about it. The reviews are terrible. I'm not gonna get that game. I'm not even gonna try it. Just try something before you just condemn it and say it's terrible. There are games that get like almost a perfect 10 and I don't like them, and then there are games that get terrible reviews like Legendary and I love them. I mean, a good example is I don't like Fallout 3. They got great reviews, I just don't like the game. I'm not much of a um, RPG typish guy, I'm just, I want a shooter, a flat out straight shooter. Uh, which is why my favorite games include something like Half-Life 2, Fear 1, and stuff like that instead of, uh, I don't know, RPGs that I don't care about, or real-time strategies. But, really, back on topic, you don't need a reviewer to tell you what's good and what's bad. When you hear something about a game, it sparks your interest, go try it. Rent it if you don't really know, if you, if you can't get it for free, rent it. So um, that's just my tiny rant. It's about 3.51 in the morning, I'm about to go to bed. <laughs> so, alright, I, I guess I'll see you guys next video. Taking my short break from uh, work and I'm going to have to start working immediately when I get right back up. Uh, FedEx is coming over to pick up all this stuff. So, um, I guess we'll see you guys next video.